doing a report in Access following up on the ELF raises and I'll go through a few things with formulas with you. I click on the query that it's based on, I click on create, and then I am just going to click on report. They have wizards, but this does it practically instantly. Looks a little weird, but it's fine, okay? I don't need that group and sort show in here. Shows things here. You can do a few things to format. If you want spaces between things, I could just click in here. I could go in here. Let's click. I'm in the layout view. And if I hold down the shift key while I'm in each one, I can make it bold. I could also go into themes here, change things here. It gives you a preview here. And let's say I like that one. And I lost, of course, my formatting that I have done. It's bold now. I could change fonts here and go into Arial make it a little easier for you to read on the screen. What I want to do here, what it did here, put a, a total here for the salary. However, you can do other formulas and I want to show you these in here. I've got this here and oops, I can move it over if I want to. Page one of one. If I don't want it, it's got that yellow orange border. Hit the delete key. I'm going to right click inside here. I am going into design view. Okay, I don't want this little icon here. We're going to add a graphic in a little while. What I want to do in here, uh, we're in the report footer. I'm going to make this a little larger here. And I want to do the average of the salary. Um, it says equal sum. It has brackets and parentheses. I type an AVG. Oops, spell it right. And then it has these other orange boxes here. I'm just going to right click inside here. I'm going to go into report view. It's showing the average salary. Go back into the design view. It's a little shallow. I can click in here, make it deeper so you can read it. What I want to do now, let's say I want to know what my total salaries are for. 2019 my expenses I could go into here I'm gonna click inside we have design arrange format here I'm gonna click in design shows many things here we're now gonna do a calculation in here we have average and sum in here so to do that I'm going into the design tab I'm going to click on the AB. It puts in a text box and a label. And a text box, let me just draw this first. This orange thing here is the text box. This is the label. It's not like the text box you see in PowerPoint. We're going to put the formula in here where we're going to determine the sum. I have it all typed in here. And then I want to just say salary total. That is a label. What I want to do now, I want things to be stacked and or arranged. And if I try to um, click inside here, I have that four-headed arrow. I try to drag it underneath. It brings the whole thing. I will undo. What I do now, I'm on the word arrange. And you click on the word stacked at the far left. And now it should work. Let's see. Sometimes you have to do it a second time. I want the um, dagger. Again, I did not do it right. Stacked. It's over here. Pull it over to here with the title above it. I click inside here. I click on stacked again. I just do it separately. I could also use the arrow keys. Hold on, I will show you this. I hit the right arrow key. Got that orange around it. This is it here. Now, it's working. Comes over here. You can see something inadvertently got moved over here. 
I'm going to fix that in a moment. I don't want that little line. I could click on it. Let's just move this up here. Again, you can see it is a little tedious. I'm going to click on stacked again. So I can push the arrows here. Oops, pull it down here. As you can see, it is time consuming. So I've got this in here. I'm going to show you this right now. I right click inside here. I go into print preview. Pass the, the, the width of the page here. I'll fix that in a minute. It's showing salary total here, showing a few other things. We could create labels over here, showing things here. We're going to format this to look like currency back in the design view. So what it is here, I could just pull this into here, pull this up a little higher. Now I go right click inside here. I go into properties. I go into format, make it currency. And I'll right click inside here, report view. You would have to go and monkey around with this. If I want to get this over aligned underneath, go back into here, go into design view. You've got to tweak this thing. I will right click inside here report view. I have to just go back into here. Pretty easy. Design view. I have to write a line in here. View. I'll go into print preview. It's wider than this thing here, but you can see how it looks a lot better. I could change things here. This is work you would have to do. It. I'd have to change in here the um, as I zoom this up a bit I would have to change the formatting here the properties I could change the color here want to show you a couple of other little things here making this look a little better let's say I want the font here to be a different thing here I could just highlight this thing here go on to home I could go in here choose another font I can make it red change the size and let's say I want to put a graphic in here. That font's rather hideous, but we're moving this thing along. I want it, I, let's say I don't want the time here. I can click on the orange box, hit the delete key. I could go into here. If I want to move it again, have to get things right on there. And again, I'm going to click on what word? Arrange stacked. And then I'm just going to hold the right arrow down. And get it in there. If I want this a little narrower, pull this in. It's probably going to show up with other things showing up there, but that's okay. I'm going to write, I want to add a graphic here of Santa. What it is, I'm on a design. I see insert image. It shows I could browse. I have this showing here. I have a little plus here with a graphic here. I just click and drag a little rectangle here. I've got a picture in here. You would spend probably more time just making this look really pretty um, than um, you know what I'm saying or you understand. I could click inside here and I can go on the home. I can change the font. Bold. I could italicize it, underline it here. And then if I right click inside here and I go into report view it's showing things here everything is red this has to be adjusted showing you the tools to get these things done